Holy Terror. Hello, it's Jim from JetsonHacks.com. On today's show, we are going to install firmware and configure the electronic speed controller to interface with the Jetson race car. Let's go! Get your motor running, head out on the highway. Okay, what we need to do next here is to load up the BLDC tool. The BLDC tool allows us to flash firmware onto the VBESC and to set configuration parameters. On the Jetson Hex GitHub account, there is a repository named install BLDC. We are going to clone that. Let's grab the address. Git clone. Then we'll switch over to that repository's directory. Let's take a look at the install script here. Basically, we'll install some prerequisites, fetch the BLDC tool, make it, and then we'll also download some configuration files from the MIT race car repository. Okay, the BLDC tool is all built. Let's switch over to that directory. Before we start the BLDC tool, let's power up the VESC. We'll plug the battery into the VESC. Now we'll start up the VESC tool. You can see the desk is attached at TTYACM0. Let's connect to it. It's running firmware version 2.18. Let's load up some firmware here. Go to the firmware. Choose. Warning, uploading firmware for the wrong hardware version will damage the desk for sure. Make sure that you choose the correct hardware version. Okay. Let's see, we want to go to firmwares. We know that's a 4.12 hardware for this particular VESC X. And we want the one that says servo out because we want to use the servo for steering. Open. And let's upload now. Writing data. And crash. Interesting. I think that's okay though. It appears that the desk has rebooted. Let's read the configuration. Oops, need to connect first. Now we can read the configuration. So all that looks good. Load XML. Let's go up a directory. Hardware, VESC. This is a VESC X. Let's use this one. Open. Let's 
Let's write this configuration. Okay. So let's reboot. <laughs> it doesn't like that at all. As soon as you reboot it, it gets upset. Let's run the tool again. Let's connect to the VESC. It's not finished rebooting. There we go. Let's read the configuration. And sure enough, it's what we need. So our VESC is reprogrammed and we should be able to teleoperate the car now. Okay, we're ready to go here. Let's test out the game controller. In order to do that, we run JS test. This is the command. We turn on the game controller and we select the proper mode. There are two modes. One is when the green light is on and the other is when it is off. When it is off is the one we want. It controls the zero and one axis with this joystick and two and three axis with this joystick. So the joystick appears to work. Let's get to control in the car. Okay, now we're ready to run the teleoperation node. Let's switch over to the race car workspace. We will source the devil. Now let's launch the teleoperation node. Okay, we get an error connecting to the Hokuyo LiDAR. That's not surprising since we don't have one installed. Well, here's the moment of truth. Let's see if the steering works. So it has a dead man switch on it. So if you just move the joystick around, nothing happens. If you hold down this button, which is the top left button, you can see that the steering works. Then the throttle is this one. So it has forward and reverse. Oh, we should turn the LiDAR on so we get the full effect. We're using Race Car J today. Prototype 001 is in the shop. <laughs> the fact is I only have one VESC right now and it's on this car. So we will use this car for the time being. More VESCs are on the way. Okay, now we have the full effect going. LiDAR spinning, go forward, turning, a holy terror.
We now have the teleoperation working, so we pretty much have a working robot at this point. As I said previously, the first chassis is in for some minor upgrades. We're putting on full springs on it and we're putting a new front bumper on it. So we'll swap that out. And that will be the end of the Jetson race car project. But we're switching over to race car J now where we can start developing software for this beast. Thanks for watching. Zoom, zoom. The shark would be quite upset if we don't have the LiDAR connected. Zoomies! Hit it back. Go forward. Straight ahead. Right. Left. Mm -hmm.